Pranam. I'm so happy to celebrate with you here and IWC family. I'm so happy to be here with you as well. You've been for the second year working closely with the brand yes, yes. as the brand ambassador. Yes. Tell me, how did your relation evolve with IWC? Well, you know, the whole team is so nice and incredible and they make me feel like family and a part of the brand and that's so important to kind of uh, establish a good relationship. Also, the product is so synonymous with uh, classic beauty and great workmanship and I think that's something that is so easy to sell for me. You know, because the product itself is so amazing, the washes are so beautiful. I love wearing them all the time. So what do you look at when you want to wear a watch or you choose a watch for like a gala dress? Um, you know, I enjoy wearing watches. Uh, I, I wear my Da Vinci uh, rose gold, uh, you every know, day. with a brow every day, every day. It's uh, something that I don't remove and uh, I enjoy that. But for like special events, I like to wear the precious watches. So I like this uh, beautiful white gold with diamonds. Or, yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been empowering women a lot lately. Tell yeah. me about your achievements. When do you feel like, mm, I've done something for the society, I've empowered women, I've I, helped? I don't think, I've, I, don't, I don't ever feel like I do enough. Um, it's important to constantly keep, you know, moving forward and keep evolving with your thought process and what you feel like you can, you can have a voice in, with, you know, or for. So um, there's a lot that can be done for female empowerment, for feminism, for equal opportunity all over the world. And um, you know, through my craft and through my art, uh, through the kind of films I choose to do, through the kind of roles I um, you know, want to essay, I think it's important to kind of say something with it. Choose to be, you know, choose to play strong, evolved women. You know, in, uh, in India and in the world, mm -hmm. you're known as a fashion icon, fashion <laughs> diva as well. <laughs> How do you want, uh, do you give it a lot of, of like attention or are you focusing on this to become the fashion icon of, of, of India specifically or it happens like with the movies you're doing and with your lifestyle? I don't, I mean my movies are very different from what my image is. Um, the kind of movies I do are very, uh, very, very, very different. Like your last one yes. this year. Yeah, yeah. So I think, um, but I just, I, my mom used to be a fashion designer and a jewel, she's a jewelry designer and she's very successful and I've grown up with fashion designers in India and internationally, you know, they've, they've been in and out of my house. So fashion for me, I look at it as art and I like to express myself through fashion, through films, through music, through dance. So anything that I can express myself through, so it's just an extension of my personality. I don't make too much of an effort. So it um, makes you happy to be dressed up. And I love, I up. love, I love dressing up. I just, I love, I love the whole idea of being a, glamorous movie star and dressing up and getting my hair done and getting my makeup done and everything. It's part of your lifestyle. Yes, it is. And beauty-wise, what do you do to like to enhance your skin quality, your makeup, your hair glow? What do you do? Um, so, I'm naturally blessed with nice hair and skin. That's the one thing I think. So you woke up like this? <laughs> no, I didn't really wake up like this at all. I obviously have a lot of people working on me for many, many hours, but um, you know, I just, I guess it's just very, I have a very healthy lifestyle. Mm -hmm. I don't smoke, I don't drink. I try to be vegetarian 99% of the time. Wow. I exercise, I drink lots of water. I'm happy. Um, so you can feel. I, feel. I sleep a lot and, um, and just that I think is just, I just having a healthy lifestyle really, really helps, you know. So now the whole world is waiting your big day. Yeah. You're the 2018 bride. Oh my God! I'm not. I don't speak about my personal life. <laughs> We're not gonna speak. But <laughs> this is it. Yeah. What 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 are your what are your biggest achievements other than working on this big day this year for 2018? Um, my I guess my film Padman just released, which was about um, how sanitary napkin this man who created sanitary napkins at a cheaper you know price in India to make them homegrown. So everybody would have, all women would have access to, uh, you know, proper sanitary napkins and, you know, menstrual, you know, menstrual hygiene is so important, but, there's you know, no there's, there's no awareness for it all over the world, mm -hmm. actually. So it, it was this man who decided to do that. So I was a part of that film. Another film that I'm doing is called Viridi Wedding, which is about four women at difficult, at a difficult age, which is the late, eight, late 20s and early 30s, and how they kind of, you know, evolve into amazing women. 
Yeah, and then I'm doing this other biopic called Sanju, and then I'm doing another film called Ek Larki Ko Dekha and Zoya Factor. So no time for wedding. <laughs> uh, no time for wedding, no time for anything. So oh my God. I but hope we see you in a Lebanese designer or Arab designer. This like is today you're wearing Ashi. I'm wearing Ashi today. I yeah, love Ashi. I love Ashi. I yeah. hope he's gonna prepare for you a dress for your wedding. I <laughs> hope so too. I don't know Ashi, are you doing anything for me? <laughs> because really, he's he, the finishing. He's excellent. His clothes, his clothes are excellent. Yeah. Do you, do you wear? You, I know you wear a lot of Elisa. Well. I do. I wear Ellie Saab a lot. Who else? Uh, I love Ellie Saab. I love Ashi. I think there's a new designer called Boo Boo. I forget his forget her. Bugesa. Bugesa. Yeah. I really like Bugesa stuff. It's so nice. It's so 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 nice. Even for gala. Uh, not for gala, it's more, more casual, casual yeah. beautiful clothes. I wore last year to no. I just wore it in Geneva actually for for IWC. Yeah. I love I love uh, the designers from the Middle East. I think they do amazing. And you look into emergent talents. You like to support yes, emergent talents. Yes, yes, I do. I do. I enjoy supporting new talent. Tell me one lesson you learned from your dad about the industry that you're working on. Like he always reminds you. So now don't forget. Everything that goes up comes down. So how do you make sure to maintain a balance? Um, you know, just that just just because you know people are looking at you and looking up to you, doesn't mean that you're better than them. It you're just always humble. Yeah, it just it's just important to be uh, grateful and gracious, be on time, work hard, and never treat anybody like you're better than them because you're not. <laughs> what is happiness for you? Um, happiness is uh, spending time with my friends and family, and doing work that kind of makes me feel satisfied. How do you define luxury these days? Luxury is, uh, you know, is a mindset. You know, anything that is of the best quality is, you know, not. I think any anything of quality. It could be the best pair of jeans, you know. Um, it could be a the most beautiful cotton T-shirt, or it could be a couture gown. But if the quality is amazing, it's well cut. Um, if you're in a, if you are in the most basic hotel, like basic room in a beautiful hotel but the sheets are the best and the water is the best and the view is the best so luxury is just quality it's not that being we feel, not that we only see. see yeah it's not about being ostentatious you're a fan of luxury yes <laughs> i can see i love i love things that are i don't know about luxury but i like things that are of the best quality what's the advice that you would give women that look up to your career and your lifestyle um, that anybody can achieve it if you work hard enough and if you are positive enough. Thank you so much. Thank Sana. you.